guys and welcome back to another match day vlog today not so at home to Crawley uh, before we get into this uh, thank you for the support on the channel over the last week I mean from like last Thursday which is the 19th to the the Thursday just gone which is the 26th we went from 84 to 92 subscribers so thank you for that and also thank you to the Grimsby fans who um, who viewed and commented on the on the Grimsby vlog uh, the support is fully appreciated uh, thank you for that as well. So yeah, we're at home to Crawley, who are 13th, I think. We are still in the bottom two, but we are out of the embargo, which is great news. Thank goodness for that. We haven't signed any players yet. Obviously, it's only been like a day. We've been rumored to. We've been rumored with Carlton Cole and Kelvin Wilson. Uh, I just hope we get a good um, more than more than four players. Yeah, I think that's an okay window for us. But I just hope we get some decent players in, and they can, and that this squad just steps up as well. You know, all the signings can't do it on the new signings can't do it on their own. These players have got to start stepping up sooner or later. Today's one of them days. Let's do this. Also, what I forgot to mention in the intro was the Grimsby vlog is now the most viewed video on the channel. So yeah, thank you for that. Uh, focus now, now turns to Crawley at home. The team news is our God's roof help us. Um, Dickinson is out, so Ordell moves to left back. Hollis comes in at centre back. Apart from that, it's the same team, which is awful. You know, I, today I would have played Osborne instead of Campbell. Uh, I would have played the ball in the midfield. At least tries to create something. Tell new signings to come in. We're stuffed. Number this seven. Of yeah, that's Enzo yeah, Baldwin. He's on, he's yeah. He doesn't like McLeod though, eh? Yeah. See, so, and it's straight back to him. Great ball. Right, it's, it's half time, it's not nil, Crawley nil. Um, really hasn't been a great game at all, to be honest. Uh, it's got even colder, it's absolutely freezing in here now. Yeah, there was a chance where Curtis cost the ball, uh, stayed at the back post, it was coming to his head and pushed their defender and gives away a free kick, which could result in a goal. Ports missed a one on one chance. We've had chances. Crawley have been great, but neither have we. Just not a great game. Free kick in free kick in dangerous position. That's not mighty. So much happens. Yes. Yeah. Free kick in all Over at Ben Davis. <laughs> Man, the space back out. Even Alan's here. Yeah, I know. I didn't wait to see. About, about 20 minutes into the second half, and all that has broken loose. Not so play decently. Yeah, not so play decently for once. I'm disappointed if we don't get anything out of this. Before we scored, Thompson has a shot, it says it comes out to Mills, it bounces into the ground, it hits the fucking ball, and then it's an absolute scramble from about two yards out, and it somehow doesn't go in. Fucking hell, what do we have to do? This is the moment. This is the moment, yeah. Come on. It's not bad. Oh my god! Had a chance to stay off the line. Curtis Thompson's been sent off. Oh, but we can't lose this. These are wank. These are awful. We can't lose these. And Thompson's just gone. Well, how come we got corded, Mike? Goes one. Calling him. Come on. Come on. A bad time. Come on! Oh. 
so happy oh we're at the relegation zone as well which is double the light it's been so long it's been so long since since we've won a game i mean we haven't won at home since september we haven't won a league game since october oh it's been long but we deserved it today absolutely deserved it 100 percent effort as well we chased down every loose ball we played really well today like in the second half the first half wasn't like wasn't a great spectacle but in the second half we really really stepped up a bit um we took the lead um i thought this is it we might actually win a game now absolutely bundled in before that we had chances for jonathan fought had two chances one where he's one on one with a keeper i think another one the other one was a header and then oh like it's unlucky Thierry Ordell had a chance cleared off the line and then a shot by Curtis Thompson saved Milsom off the bar and everybody scrambles in and it, you just, I don't know where it's going to come, come on, surely this has got to go in sometime. And it did. Um, I think it was a corner, cross game in, header, off the post, bundled off a Crawley player's leg and into the goal. It could be it. And then I think it was James Collins, you know, it was, an, it was a quality, quality goal in fairness. You know, absolutely wonderful, killing effort in, off the bar and in. It's, I don't know why, it always seems a lot better goal when it, um, when it goes off the bar and in. Um, so yeah, everyone's like, oh, bollocks. You know, it's like 86 minutes, I don't, I don't know what, it's like, it was some time in the 80, 80s minutes. Uh, no, we get a last gas goal, Aidan Ollis, he played terrific today, that lad. He's been watching videos of Roberto Carlos, he played at left back today, he was fantastic. And his shot was saved, it came out to Jonathan for. He puts it in there, I'm looking at the linesman thinking, oh no, he's going to give off side, he's going to give side. He doesn't, he runs up the touchline, keeps his flag down, and Knotts have won a football match. We have three points, we are up to 21st. Things are a lot happier this weekend. <laughs> Absolutely fantastic today. Like Michael O'Connor, what the best game I've seen him play for Knotts. Um, Curtis, absolute, he's not a right winger, okay, he's, he's first position is a centre midfielder but he was fantastic on the right today he looked like he could do it Campbell God's sake someone checked my flipping head to see if I've got a temperature Campbell or a second half or all right a few good passes you know linked up play okay I don't want to say too much because I feel like I'm wrong but Stead, Stead still needs you know he was, he was a bit tired but you know as the game went, as we got later into the game, we started to do a little bit more. Jonathan Ford, absolutely fantastic today. That man was our biggest outlet, and um, it, had to, it had to be him who scored the, the winner. But Thierry Ordell, our defence day, Ordell, Hollis, you know, Duffy and Tutel, they were great at the back. You know, Hollis, as I said, you've been watching videos of Roberto Carlos. Um, Thierry Ordell, he's like Marcel Desai today, he was fantastic. Duffy was all right today. Would you believe? Um, after all, the, after all the moaning I've done at him, uh, yeah. So happy days. We've won a game. 
if you've liked the vlog, if, if you enjoyed this vlog, give it a like, comment down below your thoughts on the game. Um, yeah, stay subscribed if you already subbed. Please subscribe, I'm only 8 subscribers off 100 now. We're getting close, it's took a long time, but we are getting there. Be safe, be champions, and as always, see you.